me. Now, folks, I ask many of you first. So love the world that he sent his son, not Mohammed, his son, Jesus Christ, that whosoever would believe in him, not Mohammed, would not perish but have everlasting life, not through Mohammed. Mohammed is dead in the grave yeah, and yeah, is yeah. a Jesus man is dead. that went to hell Jesus without is dead. Jesus. Jesus is dead. Did you get that? Oops, Jesus is dead. dead. Jesus is dead. No, no. Jesus Christ rose from the dead. How do you know? How do you know? How do you know? Wait a minute. Why are you? Show me in your please, Bible. Please, please. Show me in your Bible. Please, like Jesus go, go, go. Show me in your Bible. If I showed you, if I showed you in the Bible, you still wouldn't believe. This is the problem with the It's a way that seems right to get to God, but the end is death and destruction. That way, one of the many ways to get to death and destruction is Islam. Okay. 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 I will. I will ask you when I want to. I will want to. You never. You are never. I never. Yes. Never. You have a chance to ask me. You are the squeaker. I know you for years. You never ever give us a chance. Here is the question to my squeaker friend and a friend of me. I call him friend of me. He's the You are the speaker, Let me ask you. I will ask you a question. No, no, let me question. ask you. Please, would you shut up? There you go. Your father has arrived. No, Thank God for Canadians. Now, folks, folks, Americans will shove their religion down your throat, as they just did. But I will remind you, you stand here on your own volition. Look at this beautiful lady. You can't tell she's beautiful. She's covered. Ah, this is. She may be very ugly. This is why she comes. She could be ugly. No. Do you have a wife? Yes, I have two. Yes, there you go. He's looking for a third. He can still run. He can have two more. He thinks she's beautiful. He doesn't have to. Imagine how ugly his other two wives are. Now, I'm just having fun. Now. Folks, Muhammad, Muhammad, don't walk is away from your prophet. Muhammad is a prophet. He's not a god. No, your prophet. He's a man. He's a man. Really? Yes. Was he a sinner? He, he, he dreams, Was Muhammad a sinner? He, dreams, he did. Was Muhammad a sinner? Ah, uh, yes. Yes, he was. Yes. And did Muhammad accept Jesus Christ as his savior from his yes. sin? He, he to accepted your like Jesus that. as a prophet. So therefore he died in his sins and went to hell, 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 hell. Because he didn't. I know you don't think so, but thank God you're still thinking about it. Listen, go home to your husband, but tea is getting cold. No, no folks. That's Go to the Americans, they love you. <laughs> now, folks, did Jesus sin? Folks, if Mohammed Come on, was a sinner, question. was Jesus a sinner? No. No. So, you think Mohammed and Jesus are on the same plane? A sinner and not a sinner? Almost. So stupid. Folks, it's, it's, let's it's see. up to him or you. Just or to judge. No. I will go to someone without sin every time before I go to someone with sin, like know? Mohammed. How do you know Jesus why, is not sin? Why would Mohammed, a sinner, be a prophet? 
you see? Are you playing He said Joseph. He said you cannot. You are you playing playing he said Joseph. A prophet and a man He's on the Joseph same man. level. He said Joseph man. He should be Jesus man. was born of a virgin and he walked on this earth and he did miracles. How many miracles did Muhammad do? Countless. Name one. Name one. So I the Quran. I don't know. Go get a Quran. I don't know. I don't. He says I don't read the Quran. I don't know. I'm talking about the Quran. I'm talking about you, not me. Yes, there's none in there. There's none in there. Name one miracle that Muhammad did. The Quran. He says Quran. Whoa, whoa. What Jesus do? What Jesus, folks, what Jesus do? By the way, folks, I want you to meet the man who starred on the movie Bay. Right here in the cap. He comes every now and then. He was not selected for Babe in the City, but for Babe he was. He's an atheist. He was a very good farmer and he farmed sheep. Very good. I commend you on making that pig caused the sheep to do show what they did. One, show Thank you, show me one miracle babe, the owner of Babe. Show me one Just a minute. Jesus. Oh, I forgot I'm talking about your show religion. Show me one miracle of Jesus. Now, oh, show me. Now, question. Question. now, how now. Much time did you show me one miracle of Jesus. Just a minute. Let me pray. God will give you a brain. And then maybe you will understand that you are serving a God that has no miracles and a prophet that one. has nothing show to do one. with me mankind. One. Show me one. You want to see? Yes. Show me one miracle of Jesus. The only way you could see is by getting on your knees and asking Jesus Christ to be your Savior. God. No, Jesus. Not God. God. See? That's what happens when you are a hardened This is the place of God. You know, uh, God cannot come to the earth. You are a chicken no, and God a very chubby chicken. He created you as you are a big chicken. He cannot be like That's you. Really nice. He created you. It is no, true. Never. He cannot be like you. I know. How come? Let know that he may, he Let may... me give him a couple words of wisdom. Natural. Show me American. Two words. Yeah. Two words. You can. For you, Show sir. me American. Slim fast. Show me I'm the one miracle of Jesus now. Fast. Now, sir, good thing getting to jog. Show me one sir, miracle of Jesus. Your cholesterol is high, I can tell. Show me so is your blood pressure. Why are you talking, why are talking personal I will now. get to you in a moment and your son. I can answer how I want, lady. No, you you don't not understand. Not you are in a no, civilized no, country. You have zero knowledge. Thank you for being here. Yeah, I'm you zero must zero have well, zero, zero, zero for standing there listening to me. He is minus, minus ten nothing. I, I feel much more standing here. Did you, know. you just come from the airport or are you yeah, going to the yeah, airport? Don't yeah. change the subject. You poor guy, you yeah, just don't got here. Don't change the subject. No. Show me one miracle of Jesus now. I just told you you're not what? willing what? you're not willing to so die Jesus like Christ you. he wants like a you. miracle like he needs you. to cry to God you told him to go jogging. through you Jesus ask. Christ <laughs> there's no other way that anyone can have a relationship with their creator but through the mediator Jesus Christ how but you how? by what asking is he? What is he? I just said what is he this is what happens when you are stuck in a religion called Islam that has no way out. Now let me ask you, sir, how did you get your sins forgiven with Allah? How do you? You've got a lot of them, I can tell. What? I don't know this. So you don't even know how? No, I don't know. Why do I have to know? So, how do I know? How do I know? Allah doesn't even give him wisdom to know how. How do you know? To get right with the How do you know Jesus? I just told you. How do you know Jesus forgives you? You're a sinner. How do you know Jesus You're a sinner. Who are you? And you need God's grace. How do you know Jesus forgives you? You need God's grace. The Bible says, you know what? For grace, we are saved through faith. It is the gift of God. Oh, just shout it. It is not by works. No wisdom. Or we would boast like this. But Jesus, Jesus did it all. No, I'm not a sinner.
Jesus did it all. Jesus did it all. Jesus did it all. Just a minute, can you read? Because Muhammad, Muhammad was illiterate. Did you know that? Yeah. Oh, yes. Allah, the, the, the great God, the smart God that only knows Arabic, gave Muhammad a book and said, read, and Muhammad said, I'm illiterate, remember? Yes. Yes. You see, that's their God. But he read a book. But he read. It never says he read. He read because he had bedtime stories told him by his grandma. But why didn't him? Jesus Christ. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. What's your God? Are you saying God? Who's your God? You just said the Holy Spirit. You said the Holy Spirit told him God. Does who's your God? Does Allah have a spirit? No, no, no. Whoa, whoa, whoa! He said the Holy Spirit. God. Stupid again. <laughs> Every now and then he forgets. <laughs> Just a minute, I'm celebrating. Hold your butt. Hold your butt. Hold your butt. No, hold your butt. No, Who's your God, folks? Who's your God? Without knowing Jesus Christ as your Savior, you will go by intellect. Who's your God? Like this man. I'm talking about God and you don't know who's your God. Tell me, who is your God? Do you believe in Allah? Yes. All right. Who is Allah's prophet to you? Muhammad. Can you answer better than this poor pitiful creature? Well, I'm asking you. I am asking you because he couldn't answer. What miracle did Muhammad do? Quran. Quran. Well, well, look at Quran. Quran. It's all over you. You have two wives. Quran. Quran. Hey, hey, what? Are you married? Quran is a No, he wants you. He's got two and he wants you. Oh, you have no idea how cheap you sound. He can have for you now. Let me answer. You can't no, see that man. Exactly. Okay. What we miracle? We have one Quran. We don't have other copies. Not like the Bible. How many? How many how copies? Many Just a minute. How many, how I love copies? to talk about the Bible. How many? How many versions? All the Muslims. <laughs> how many? How many versions there are of, of the Bible? Which version? No. Why? No. No. Why, 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 why don't you show me what miracle of Jesus? This is what happens when you're from the Middle no, East. No, 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 you all talk at the same time. Choose one person to talk. Remember, we're in a democracy. Tell me one miracle of Jesus. Half an hour ago, he said that you don't look at democracy. No, he says we're in democracy. Let me tell you about the amazing Allah, according to them. Allah is so smart that Allah gave the Quran to Muhammad that cannot read or write. That's a miracle. Yes, yes it's yes, a miracle yes. because yes. it's so stupid. It's, it's miracle, so yeah. stupid. He did not read or write. Yeah, he didn't. Yeah, he, he, he never wrote something. Never wrote. Not, he could not read yeah. and he could not That's write. That's a miracle. Yeah, yeah. So, folks, now, they say that the Quran in Arabic is the only true word. Yeah. Yes. Yes. What, what's the language? The that means you've got to learn Arabic to know the true word. Millions. Yes, Adam. How many of you Quran. know Arabic? Millions. One, Millions. two, three, four, five, six, seven. The rest of you go to hell. No. no. That is the truth of Islam unless because because Allah is such a little God, he only knew Arabic. He did not know any other language, so he said Arabic is the only one. Because their God, their God is so little that he could not interpret or have it accurately interpreted the same in the other with languages. The same heaven with Jesus. Like the God of Israel. The same heaven with Jesus. The same happened with Jesus. Just a minute, I'm celebrating. The same happened with Jesus. 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 The same happened with
Folks, the Bible is hip is so great. The Bible you can read the, the Bible in Spanish. No, you can it's read the Bible in English. No, you can read the Bible in Arabic. God is able to be understood. There is no Arabic Bible. Islam. There is no Arabic Bible. There is no Arabic Bible. What was the Bible? There is no Arabic Bible. The amount of Arab, yeah, yeah. Let, let him literate people on the earth is one to 10,000. Yet, look at what's going on. It's probably greater than that. So what is probably going on? Folks, the God, what's going on, man? The God of Muhammad was limited. He was limited. And he is the only Jesus. the language of Jesus. 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 But God, the God of Israel, can be interpreted in Hebrew and Greek in every other language. No. Praise be to saying. God it's Almighty. Translated. He's not God a little. God's word, whether you argue about it or not. God's word is alive and powerful and is like a sword in the spirit. When it is when it is translated. Did you just get here? Did this guy just walk up? It is translated. I'm not funny, you know. Well, that's okay. Yeah, not funny. Well, then stop laughing. Okay, I'm not funny. Because you are not making any joke of yourself. Word is a lie. I will live. I speak so much for this Have you read it before? I will live. Have you read God's word? Ref, ref. I will live. Have you? Come on, ref. No, you will stay. Shut I will go. You will stay. I you will go. only go when I tell you. Fuck your red You will God. only go when I your tell God. you. Fuck you. Your red that God. is a Muslim cursing. You will now go. Well, you are... See how easy that is. Uh, you will now stop. Feeling better now? Feeling pretty good, yes. You will also go because that's probably your I'm not, your I just friend. remember. I'm, Take LSD, okay? No, bro, I'm you'll end up with wearing a cowboy hat. Jesus now. Christ, <laughs> your words and your life is without hope. Jesus is the hope of all humanity. That is why Jesus said, I am the way. He said that you're the, the way and the life. The truth and the life. That's right. Finally. It's not cider or alcohol that is life. That's just a byproduct to get your mind somewhere else. Ah, oh, now we're into biochemistry. Well, no, you are, but not we. No, 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 no. You are. Well, why? Let me ask you, Rod. Why do you drink? My name what isn't is Rod. Rob, sorry. Why do you drink? I've got two names now. So, Rob, right? You me? No. I know yes. that you're a decent guy, but the way you appear, you're a decent I'm guy. I'm asking you a question. The way you appear Why to me, do you drink? Because the way that you appear to me is no different to the way that those guys refer to you. No difference. No Rob, difference. the way I appear to you yes. has very little to do with the way I know I appear to God. Yes. So you. if I appear for a certain you, way to you, for you, it doesn't matter if I please God. Go and buy, well, go and buy another one. I'll take it in my own time. But I'm sorry, I didn't find any other idiot. Here is a Muslim helping a guy. He's a with human a being, man. I'm a human being. Yes, you are a human being. Yes. And a big being. I'm not a now. monkey. Why can't you be fair to the guy? I was not even invited. Why do you drink? I told you. Because he's Christian. Well, I haven't told you. Because he said. Because it's more entertaining than what comes out of the mouths of people, including you, at Speaker's Corner. It's entertaining. You are a creationist. That's okay. Oh, shut up, you silly bastard. Hello everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to be showing how Muhammad himself uh, proves that he is not the prophet. Now, when I was a Muslim, um, I believed that uh, Muhammad was the prophet. I can swear that to you on the, the Holy Bible. This is what I believed and I also believed that, um, that the Quran was, was the word of God. Okay? These are fundamental 
these are fundamental beliefs for a Muslim, okay? And, um, and, and one day I actually met people, um, some Christians who were saying, well, you know, he's not a prophet. I, you know, we don't believe him. And I said, what do you mean he's not a prophet? He proved it. And, uh, and, and, I, and I wanted to get some verses, actually, to, to show them the proof. And that's when I found um, what I now call the merry-go-round verse in the Quran. Do you know what a merry-go-round is? Something that goes round and round and round and round. And um, it, it, is, it is just like the circular logic that you find um, in, in Muhammad's um, proof that he's a prophet. And, and it, and it um, shows undeniably how Muhammad um, is not a prophet. So what is this, what is this um, merry-go-round verse I'm talking about? Um, it is in uh, Surah 10, Ayah 94. It says, So if you, Muhammad, are in doubt concerning that which we have revealed unto you, i.e. that your name is written in the Taurat and the Injil, then ask those who are reading the book, the Taurat and the Injil, before you. Verily, the truth has come to you from the Lord. So be not of those who doubt it. Okay, um, so 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 he's um, you know he kind of he needs he needs to turn to the to the Torah and the Injil to prove his prophethood, just like everyone else. You see, the scriptures that came before, uh, you know, are like are like a prophethood passport. You kind of you need the scriptures that come before you to prove that you're a prophet. Okay, um, and and um, Muhammad. Um, and, and it says even here, you know, you need to go back to prove that Muhammad's a prophet. You need to go back to the Injil and the Taurat. You know, it, it, this needs to be done. And, and, you know, Angel Jibril is, is, is um, although I don't believe it's Angel Jibril, but this is what it says, that Angel Jibril told uh, Muhammad, you know, that, that it, it is from the, in the Taurat and from the Injil that you find the proof that you are the prophet. Now, I've got a big problem with that. Uh, that is that... <coughs> Um, so if the Injil and the Torah are your passport to prophethood, i.e. proof of your identity as a prophet, they're not going to be accepted if they're corrupted or they're lost. You cannot have a corrupted passport, neither can you have a, a lost passport without a, a, a solid you know, without an uncorrupted passport, um, you, you cannot enter. And, 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 I, and I just kind of, for me, Muhammad is like, um, you know, has been for, what is it now, over a thousand years, he's just been this prophet who's been stuck at the, um, at the gates of the, the prophethood club with his, with his corrupted and his lost uh, prophethood passport. And he's not able to get in, you see, because he needs an uncorrupted Injil and an uncorrupted Taurat and he needs a present Injil and a present Taurat i.e. not one that's been lost somewhere he needs to have it with him to prove that he's a prophet um, now you, uh, Muslims you see <coughs> they, 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 um, they, 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 they realize this contradiction they, they realize they need to go to the Injil and the Taurat to prove that, that Muhammad is the prophet so what do they do? Uh, they, they, they pick out verses, you see, they pick out maybe one or two verses that um, if you remove the entire context and you uh, massively misread uh, the actual words, you might just even believe that it might just be a prophecy of Muhammad. But you see, there's a problem with that, which is um, um, they reject the other verses in, in, in the Bible, in the Torah, in the Injil, which totally contradict Muhammad, you see, Muhammad says that Jesus was not crucified. Um, it says that in the Injil. It says that in the same gospel, the Gospel of John, um, and, uh, uh, and, and other gospels, which Muslims themselves use to prove that Muhammad is a prophet. Now, do you see the problem with that? You see, you cannot, you know, I'm not going to forbid you, actually, to use the Torah and the Injil to prove your prophet wrong until you accept the whole thing. Because until you accept the whole thing as true, uh, you know, don't even come with your verses because they, they're meaningless to me as far as I'm concerned. They're corrupted. They're corrupted, you know, um, and they're meaningless. You, you cannot pick and choose like this because it is the shakiest, the shakiest attempt at proving your prophet is true in history and it just does not work, okay? Every prophet needs to prove that he's a prophet and how does he do that he refers to the previous scriptures the previous scriptures need to be in line with what he's saying it even says so 
in, in the Quran, this is why in Surah 10, uh, Ayah in 94, um, Muhammad is being referred to the Taurat and the Ijib. You see, it doesn't work without referring to the previous scriptures. It doesn't work. Now, um, I, I, I just, you know, I, I really don't know what to say um, beyond this because it's, it's just clear to me that um, Muhammad has failed um, for, for you know, over a century to prove that he is a prophet. Now, uh, until he's able to prove that he's a prophet, you have to continue believing in all the prophets that came before him. And you also have no basis on which to, to argue that the, the, the Injil and the Torah have, uh, um, and the scriptures that we read are corrupted because, or that they are, um, or that they've been lost because it, you no longer have a prophet that you can, and you no longer have a Quran or a word of God that you can refer to to prove that point because, uh, you see, because, because your prophet hasn't been proved and neither has your Quran been verified. Uh, and uh, until you do that, you're just going to have to follow what came before, okay? Um, that's all that I have to say for today. Um, prove that, prove that um, Muhammad is a prophet and you're going to find it's impossible. That's what I found. And, and that is why I cho chose to stop denying the, the verified, the proven words of God that came from the verified prophets. And I've just discounted this. And I've discounted his, the false prophet who brought this. Because the evidence on which he um, claims his prophethood is circular. And it is... Um, it, and it shows that he is, without a shadow of a doubt, not a prophet. So, um, so yeah, that's that's kind of what I have to say today. This this Quran, um, this book is um, is all it's really useful for, I think, is just <coughs> is just pointing out the contradictions, so that um, so that Muslims hopefully will one day, um, yeah, stop denying the words of God. Uh, I, um, I just want to pray as well. Father God, um, I thank you, Lord, that you um, that you revealed yourself to me even when I denied you, Lord God. Um, I pray, Father, that um, you would open the eyes and ears of those, all those who are listening, Lord God. Um, Father, um, yeah, I just pray that you would you would um, shine your your light and your truth into their heart, and I pray that they would not deny the truth any longer. Um, yeah, thank you, Lord God. Um, amen. Good. Thank you so much, everyone, for, for stopping by. Um, I wish that you have a blessed day. And thank you so much again for all of your support. Lots of love. Bye-bye.